Hey y'all, this is Anna Alexander. Welcome to my bedroom as we are returning to season three, episode two of The Legend of Vox Machina. And we are out looking for more vestiges, but the one we wanted, Anna Ripley has, and it seems as if she has others. Oh, and she's got whatever it was, the spell, the ookie gookie, whatever it was Percy had that fed his vengeance. She, it's now in her, it's now in her. Cool, because that's what we need is more obstacles. <laughs> so I'm ready to just jump right into it. So we're going to get Cozy Comfy ready. I have my water on standby. You are going to remember that you can watch the full episode of Watch Along on my Patreon, where I would love to see you. And um, as my phone's going off notification-wise, get that real quick, and then we'll get right to it. Use him to give you thousands more to feed on. So they kidnapped Percy. I'm sure you remember how eager Orthax can be. Orthax? Is that its it name? Has a name. <laughs> and it's you name. never bothered to ask. <laughs> you destroyed okay. it. No, you, you left didn't. It a whisper. Without your design, we never would have been able to upgrade it. And what exactly do you plan on doing with it? And me. What you should have done long ago. Share your gifts with the wide, wide world. So we have a side quest now besides the dragons. Now we've got to fight Ripley and Orthax. What the hell? Oh, we've got the oh, intro. Oh, unhappier times. Right, sir, your soul belongs to another. Wow, this this is a major Oh no. Oh no. This is a major, major upgrade from previous seasons. Tired already. <laughs> I'm already traumatized. <laughs> and now it's just a vision. <laughs> oh no. This whole trip is a disaster. Okay. I knew we shouldn't have listened to Raishan. We had to try for the vestige. Wait. I got thoughts. Back to the archives. Okay, I get it. Keyless would not trust the person that killed a bajillion people she loved and adored and whatnot. But you also cannot turn away any possible lead. Nor their master. Think they'd take kindly to a coquettish wink? <laughs> Believe me, I've tried. Surely you have some glorious distraction. I did not come back to Ankarel to get arrested. <sighs> Fine. Before I change my mind. Ooh! Oh, what? Your pepper box was a fine beginning. But imagine if there were a hundred. More. That's chaos. That's equality. You created something revolutionary, Percy. Have I not been paying attention that Percy was the only one with a firearm? Because <laughs> me, my head, anything can be a weapon. <laughs> You and Orthax seem to have figured it out. What do you need me for? The vestiges. A power supply. The killer didn't enter the same way we did. They came through this window. Hmm? Okay. <laughs> That's Eridos acid. We used it in the clasp. Oh, I'm back. So I was in a thieves' guild. I'm so cool. Seven days a week. No. Ah, balls, no, it's us, it's us. Oh, this homecoming will be the death of me. He did not just prophesize, did he? Where might a girl go for rare elemental acid? I know the place, unfortunately. Come on. Oh. While I rest a second, the doctor's going to take a solo. This next ditty is about a girl I met across the sea in Nicodronis. 
Well, it caught me by surprise when I... You know, they're all in this little town looking rather merry, knowing that the rest of the world is burning down around them. <laughs> that plate can absorb fire. And the cloak? It controls and redirects magic. Create an arcane factory. You want to mass produce your weapons. Once the weak rise up, what's to stop the oppressed from becoming oppressors? That's why I need you, Percy. You understand humanity far more than I. My factory is inevitable. Wouldn't you rather be the one at the controls? Unless you kill her. Right? That was a terrible, terrible reflection. Well, I've got good news and bad news. <gasps> Ooh! Damn it. Percy could be dead by now, and we have no idea where he is. We'll think of something, sister. Uh huh? Wait, 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 what? Okay, but he's playing with the firearm. <laughs> it's a pretty fun game, but um, have you ever seen weapons like that? That was my question. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Um, can you tell me where? Hey! Great work, buddies! The old Basilica, Northwest District, past the Temple of Onyx. Ten minutes away. Mm-hmm. Oh! Halt! Maybe 15? We're easy, fellas. I, I know it seems bad, but we're not here to cause trouble. Uh, we're not? <gasps> Run! Go! I'll catch up! Is this where we lose Sean? Got my coverage. Might have to rethink the whole shaking thing. Fly, <laughs> pick up, Vax, and fly. I didn't want to see you. Nothing's changed. I traveled thousands of miles for this conversation. You came all this way for me. Well, yeah. No. <laughs> I mean, technically, we needed this item that might help save the world, but you were right up there. Of course. The hands out there looking for some foreigners. What did it? Oh, I'd hate to be them. He saw real in the heart. Calls to him. It's heat fueling a world at war. This is very disconcerting. <laughs> so he can hear it. Your theory was correct, Dr. Ripley. With magic and engineering, you can fashion an incredible power source. That does what? Or incinerate a maniac. Get the messages. You toy with us! I don't remember Percy having this sort of a power when he had Orthax in him. Oh. No shit. I've got a to you. And a demon thing, Percy forgot to add that. Where is she? Where? <laughs> oh, no. Kiki, can you? Yeah, I was like wondering who's kind of light source. <laughs> Pike. A little help. Uh, he had the vestiges like touching distance. Maktoum! Hmm. Ram Jan! By order of their highness, Jamon Sahor, you are all under arrest. I I'm sorry, okay? I'm just uh, nervous to talk to you. When I'm on stage, I'm golden. Straight fire. But when the loot goes down, I kind of... I don't know who I am. And I'm supposed to help you figure it out? No. Well, I, I mean, yes. This way! Uh, I think one more drink would really help me open up. <gasps> I'm 
walking with their little ropes. <laughs> their reverence, the Emperor Jamon Saor. Is it, what's her name? Was it Rashawn or, huh? Oh, she has a dragon. Or they have a dragon. Huh. Vox Machina, you have been charged with royal theft and murder. It was Ripley! This psychotic scientist, she killed your friend. And she might be working with the green dragon, who's actually the one who sent us here, even though I said we probably shouldn't listen to her. And I'm not helping. I'm not helping, am I? Mm -mm. Amongst your possessions were vestiges of divergence, just like the two missing from my archives. Were you not here to steal them? Uh, technically, yes, but we... Uh, failed? And you, carrying a custom black powder... Oh, they were searched thoroughly. Then I have no choice but to sentence all of Vox Machina to death. Stop! Of course. It was me. Percy! Percy. I did it. Percy. I take full responsibility for the murder of Mistress Asharu. What is his plan? I throw myself upon your mercy. Honesty is rare these days, and my people are nothing if not merciful. Very well. What is his plan? Prepare him for the transformation. Into what? Huh. Okay. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. I want to be in your wife. Uh, life. And she sat around long enough for him to get this drunk. How could I be so stupid? Go back to your pathetic little adventures and leave me alone. No, no, kid. <laughs> oh, oh. Please don't go. Oh, oh. Scanlon? Uh, Scanlon! <laughs> Still in the. What the hell? You took a life. And while we will not take yours, we will transform it into something more honorable. More honorable. Do you have any final words before you join my service? Oh, one of these dudes? We're really getting this? We're really getting this. Objection! What? Wait, what? What? My timing is just... <laughs> wow. I have new eminence to present. You'll need my sword. Miss Carver. Look into the blade. Can't have you watching. So you were telling the truth. <laughs> the group known as Vox Machina is cleared of all charges. Well, that's delightfully handy. <laughs> you didn't need to take the blame. But I am to blame for what I made. For letting it loose in the world. Hmm. I was ashamed. And above all else, I just didn't want you to see me that way. Drowning in guilt won't bring you what you want. And what is it I want? <laughs> yeah, I don't know either. At peace? Does Percy want to be at peace? Just peace. With the world. Without that vestige, we have no chance against Thordax Fire. That would be true, if she had actually stolen the plate of the Dawn Martyr. Wait. I have witnessed firsthand Thordax Fury. I did the only responsible thing. I replaced it with a forgery. That somehow Percy got to work to make into a big bomb? I hid it in a place beyond even Thordak's reach. Are you familiar with the Hells of Despat? As in Hell's Hells? Like blood and demons and all that cool shit? The plate is with a demon called Xerxes Ilares, an antiquities collector in the city of Dis. I have a thought. I think the reason I have such trouble remembering the names and places in the show because it seems as if they came up with the names by sticking a bunch of Scrabble tiles in a bag 
throw them together. The Ancarl de Sel de Butchadu. <laughs> the Isle of Dis and Sin and Menachnite. <laughs> so I'm going to forget things really easily. All right. So going back to Keyleth and Keyleth feeling as if nobody was listening to her. Again, does she have a reason to be distrusting of this dragon shapeshifter? Absolutely. But there is a bigger picture. And this is when I want people to do what I would do. <laughs> Even though we're not the same. And we've had different backgrounds and, and histories and whatnot. So distrustful, yes. But you also have to be open to possibilities because you are fighting something that is beyond anything you've seen before and that's another thing is this season three the same campaign it's the same campaign isn't it from season two that they're remaking this one is so massive and we're taking so long to get anywhere i think that's why i'm losing and it's been a year and a half between seasons taking me longer to catch up and some of you have been great throwing me things to catch me up yes but it's still going to take a while for me to connect because a big thing for me when i'm watching the story is that motivation what is the character's goal realistically or not obtainable or not physical or spiritual and right now the biggest goal has been to take down the dragons because the dragons are danger cool well it looks like we've got percy dealing with guilt okay Vax, Vax's goals have changed because now he's been beholden to this matron. Keely was supposed to go on her little quest, walk about. I think she still needs to complete it. Now we've got Scanlan thrown in with this daughter that he has no idea what to deal with. So there's lots still left to go. And the thought of that journey is exciting as well as it is exhausting to think about. Man, for half a second, I thought we were going to lose Percy to the big Rocky Goon Squad. <laughs> okay, there you go. Episode two. Thank you so much for joining me on this adventure. And do not be strangers. So if you haven't already, please hit subscribe. It will let you know when the next video drops. I would greatly appreciate it. And until next time, this is your reminder to stand, walk around the room a little bit, get some more water, and then come back and watch the next video in the queue. So thanks again, y'all, and until next time.